All right, family, so I had to come and do this one for you guys today. You know I was scrolling through another Facebook group, and I have something else for you today. Stay tuned. All right, family, let's just get right to it. So, again, scrolling through one of my Facebook groups, and here is the message that I ran up across. Somebody's getting some, uh, <laughs> somebody wants some help here. So, it just, my husband wants us to file a joint tax return for 2017 so his back child support can be paid off this year. I told him no, and he called me selfish. Why do I have to pay for his mistake? Am I being fair? Um, yeah. So let me just say, it really just depends on y'all relationship. Uh, honestly, it really does. Because what works for me might not work for you. However, I will say that what is the big deal with you helping out your husband to get that back child support up off of him? Here's the thing. I noticed you're thinking like, well, I, I didn't, you know, I didn't help pay or, or didn't not help him pay. You know, how come he didn't pay or whatever? And um, that is also a true statement as well. How come he wasn't taking care of his stuff? However, here's what you failed to realize. You probably knew that he wasn't paying child support or at some point he told you that he wasn't. And you still married him. So now you have automatically taken on his burden you've automatically taken on his debt because you married him it's no different in student loan debt it's no different so like i hear a lot of people that don't even want to get married because of their student loan debt is so high and they don't really want their partner to pay for that but if you say i do now you two are supposed to be a team together. Why would you not want to get that up off of your family so then you can move forward onto something else? Why would you not want your husband to win while he is with you? You kind of are coming off as selfish. Now, I get it. It's your money, right? Personally, it's your money. But it's also helping the household. It's also not money that you personally, you or your husband, have to come out of pocket to pay. If you have the money, why wouldn't you want to help him out? How much love do you actually have for this guy? For now, your husband. I get it. He should have took care of that. But the reality is, he didn't. And now you said I do. And the government wants your money because your money is his money nobody said it's fair how am i able to speak on this you say because it actually happened to me no joke i filed we actually filed separate no i'm lying we did file together with my ex-husband he was behind on his back child support and i didn't agree to it but guess what the government did they were so gracious and so kind to just go into my account and take it from me and I had no idea what was going on because I was at the bank trying to withdraw some money. Couldn't withdraw nothing because guess what? It was gone. And yes, I ain't going to lie, of course I was pissed off. But at least in your instance, you knew. See, I didn't know he was behind in child support. I actually didn't know that I was taking on that debt either. <laughs> but now that I'm older and especially if you are younger, listen to this. When you get with your spouse, their debt becomes your debt. So if you don't want their debt, don't say I do right away. Clean up your finances before you get married and then you don't have to worry about this stuff. Be open. Be honest. Ask a multitude of questions. That way you know what you're getting yourself into. Nobody said it was fair. Life ain't fair. Life ain't easy, but it's all about choices. And you chose to say, I do. So now you should choose to help your husband out. It's my own personal opinion. Let me know what y'all opinion is. Do you even agree with me? Or do you agree with her? Is she being selfish? She's not being selfish. Should she not help him out? I sincerely want to know what you 
guys think. I personally think that it is now a partnership. It is a team effort. And if you can get this thing off of his back and off of your back, then you can absolutely allocate the funds and everything else that's coming in some other way. There's always going to be child support until she is old enough or he is old enough to be off of your husband's, you know, um, him sending out payments. But at this point, the children are not. I just personally feel that you should have them out. But anyway, I absolutely want to hear what you guys have to say. If you like this video, of course, give me thumbs up. Do not forget to hit the red subscribe button if this is your very first time here. Or if you have been here multiple times and have not hit the red subscribe button as of yet. Because here at I Love Me Me Me, I am helping you guys with all of the tips and tools in order to have happy, healthy, romantic relationships. Especially healthy, happy marriages. Absolutely. Especially in this case. Don't forget y'all, I just released my three online courses. The information is down in the description box below. I have a course for my singles. I have a course for my people that are in the dating stages. And I also have a third course for all of you who are in long-term relationships or in marriages. Check out the courses. Let me know what you think. At the end of all of them, I have a survey so you can let me know what you think of the entire program. I would definitely want and need your feedback. Help your sister out. The discount codes are in the description box below. I will see you tomorrow. Deuces.